when we try and talk to you, you'd flip out and start screaming. He would get really upset. It was like a very confusing fight. I have some guilt. I felt like a burden to the people around. It's scary. I can't do it. And your friends are like, no, you have to face this. You can get really creative explaining away everything, but there was like a much simpler explanation. What is PTSD? Post-traumatic stress disorder. We get a lot of questions across the country. Mm -hmm. and a lot of it is about the misconceptions. There is a change in the brain that occurs when someone goes through a trauma like combat, like an assault, like a severe natural disaster. Let us dispel some of the myths. When you think of PTSD, you think of that guy that snaps and shoots his wife in the face. And that is not how it presents most of the time. It looks like depression. It looks like isolation. It looks like anxiety. But really, it's all of those things wrapped up. It was a Vietnamese ground attack. What I saw, what I did, it still plays on my head. The training teaches you that you have no right to your fears. This is just something wrong with me. I just must be messed up. What's the worst trauma that you've experienced? Seeing my husband get blown up in front of me. When I first announced that I was stepping back from public life and get treatment, I realized how many people really wanted to talk about this. This is the thing that happened. This is where your brain broke, and this is where we have to go back to fix it. I don't want to take away your memory. I want to take away the control the memory has had over your life. Trauma is trauma is trauma. It does not make a difference in what shape, form that it takes on, childhood, adult, whatever it is, it's trauma. I can't drive my car. I'm paranoid that somebody is following me. You get that sick feeling in your yeah. stomach. You start sweating. There is no magic pill for PTSD. If we can get that right fit of therapy to individual, we can actually make dramatic improvements. We're going to fall. Question is, are you going to fall down? Or are you going to fall up? If we work for it, we can be in total remission from our PTSD. You know, you make two steps forward, one step back. I don't think it's ever too late to get your life back. It's given me hope. You didn't give up on me. Here is better. Here is better.